pump the blood on the body. Very good. So simply the heart is a pump. But without the heart, right, we don't have any blood anywhere in the body. So where are the important places the blood goes? So, so the heart pumps the blood, which is an important organ of the body that you need the blood to go to. So she says the liver. Yes, and my friend, where is he? Mr. Burns, his liver is suffering this morning, I think. So the liver is important. What, to, what does the liver do? It helps to replace the that's, um, it can help with that, right? The pancreas is regulating the sugar. That's what it releases. The best way to think of the liver is it's a filter for the body. It filters out some of the bad things that we put into our body, and then it also produces some enzymes that help break down some food to, to molecules that can be absorbed. What other organ is important that the heart is pumping to? Right, the brain, right? All of you, if the heart does not pump blood to the brain, then the brain does not receive oxygen. Without oxygen, right, we, we, don't, we don't live. So we must have oxygen. So the heart is so important because it pumps the oxygen to all of the body. So when the heart is failing, then oxygen doesn't get delivered to the important parts of the body. And you see on the outside of the heart, it's dark. This is actually... The heart has to pump blood, and then this blood is supplied back to the heart. Because the heart is like a muscle. It's like any other muscle in the body, it needs the oxygen supply. So there, and this red pipe here is actually blood leaving the heart, and then it goes here up to the brain. So this is the blood vessels that go up here. Then this pipe goes down to the liver, stomach, legs. So all of the blood comes out of this area. And if we open the heart, Right, so I open up the heart, you get to see the chambers of the heart. And the main pumping chamber is something we call the left ventricle. Okay, so there are four chambers, right? Right ventricle, so if I put this back, you don't see it as well. If I open it up, you can see the four chambers. The right side, the left side, and then there's these other chambers called the atrium on the top, and also on the atrium on the top. There's also valves that the blood has to go through to get, leave the body. So these are the valves between the two chambers. So it's a pump with four chambers, simply. But to keep this pump healthy, what do you have to do? So you have to do some things, you have to avoid some things, right? So the worst thing for the heart is what? Don't smoke. Smoking is the worst thing for the heart because it makes the blood vessels here narrow so they become blocked. What else is bad for the heart? Alcohol can be bad for the heart, it weakens the heart. And then eating too much nyamachoma, right? You want to have a diet that has vegetables, right? And fruits, beans some rice, and then physical activity is good for the heart, right? And the brain. So everything that's good for the heart is good for the brain. Because if you don't have blood flow going to the brain, then you don't right, have the ability to work. So that's, Im that's important. So for the heart, important things to remember. It's a pump, the pump that supplies oxygen to the body, and to keep the heart healthy, you have to have a healthy lifestyle. Many of you, right, you've been learning this now for some time here at the program, how to live healthily so it keeps your mind and your body safe.